Hello and welcome to another video from the Grace Trail on YouTube and it is episode 40 of my FIFA 15 Burnley career mode and crikey we have gone quite far with this now in this episode we will have two games at home to Cardiff and then away to Liverpool sort of carrying on the tradition of the past couple of games where we've been facing an easy team at home and facing a difficult team away whether I'll continue my bizarre form I don't know considering the results I've had recently but this is a team we're going with against Cardiff a team we've never faced before in this career mode um, so we've got Guadessi up front we've brought Jerome in he hasn't played in a while I think he might have a bit of a chip, a chip on his shoulder Guadessi has to keep up front he's been so good this season I had to keep him up there and Ings just cannot score and Juskovic has dried up a bit our field has come back into the side cause it, because he said that he will keep putting performances even in even though he wants to leave and we've just kept the normal back four because they have actually been pretty solid uh, minus a few mistakes which have probably been more down to me to be fair but we need to go ahead screwed on now because we need we need to get two strong results in this episode to, to keep in the hunt because we, we're able to kind of get ourselves out of jail in the last game against Manchester United we can't afford to lose to Cardiff again here like we did to Leicester well guys, I think it's worth pointing out here that I'm, I'm pretty sure we haven't won at Turf Moor this season. Which doesn't bode well for us because for whatever reason our away form has just been immense and our home form has been poor. But you can see there, Cardiff have been promoted. They're only 19th, so this should be a relatively easy win. But uh, I do worry about this game because there's kind of that unknown factor with them. But we need to get the job done if we want to get into the top four against teams like this. But we haven't been doing that enough recently, so we need to do it now. Goal for Leicester. Nugent scored. Reed couldn't get there, and this is dangerous here. Tedder! And that is the first real chance of the game. And it's gone to them. Not a great start. Marnie will get there. He's found Jerome. Uh, it's come to... Kitely, who hits it! Good save by Marshall, I think it was, and Kitely, who's been in form, almost scored an absolute screamer there. Fabio now. Oh, it's come to Ekrim, and he's done well there, and it's a chance here. It's a real chance! Oh, I don't believe it. What is wrong with me? 1-0 down to Ipswich, 1-0 down to Leicester, 1-0 down to Cardiff. And it's another mountain to climb against a terrible team at home. And it's the f it's only the second real chance of the game and it's just poor defending. And it's an easy finish for the striker. Oh dear. Kitely can attack the defender. It's not a bad ball. And Jerome! And it's over the bar again. And we almost instantly replied there, but it wasn't cl quite close enough. Just over. Oh, it's well played. Oh, for goodness sake. Well, there's no way back now. And I, I just don't get this. Every time... I play a bad team at home, they just go into beast mode and I start failing. I mean, that's a, you can't really stop that. He's just lashed it into the top corner. There's nothing Heaton could have done about that. Yet when we play teams like Man United and Chelsea, they barely threaten. Uh, I, d I don't know. We need a miracle now. Well, the turf more curse continues. As you can see from the shots and the shots on target, it's been pretty equal. They've had a lot more possession. I just cannot seem to get the ball off them whatsoever in this game. And that's probably been the defining factor in the scoreline at the moment. We need to have find something different in the second half here, otherwise it's not going to get any better. And that's a bit of a weird ball, but it, oh, typically it finds noon. And now it's played back across and, oh my word. Well, that was just typical FIFA there for a moment. Luckily it didn't go in. Oh, well won there by Guadetti. And now we're bursting forward with Guadetti. And that's got to be a free kick. Okay, guys, we're just going to go into full effort mode here. Ings, Howie, Sundjutskovic on and we're going to go attacking here because we need to find something. 
And now it's into Dritzkovic. Oh, it's hit the bar. That sums it all up. Ah. Uh, Oh, that's well won, though. And now it's into Dritzkovic, and this is a chance to get a goal back. And he has to finish it, and he hits the post. Ings, at least he gets a damn goal. And now we might be able to get back into it, because Danny Ings has scored a goal. We finally just about pushed it in after Dritzkovic hit the woodwork for the second time in a row. It's not going our way, but if we could get an equaliser here, it would be a miracle. Oh, we haven't got rid of it now. Oh, what a pile of crap that is then. We've lost to Cardiff. It's an absolute joke. We've hit the woodwork about f five times. And I really think the game just wanted me to lose that because it did not go my way at all. The passing was so off. We've hit the post so many times. And now we we'll just have to go on to Liverpool game, which if the form book tells us anything, we will win. Okay, guys, it's the Liverpool game up next. It will be the tenth game of the season. We are now six points away from the top four, like we were before the Manchester United game, so it is absolutely vital that we at least get a point out of this, preferably a win. We've never lost to Liverpool um, on this career mode. We beat, we did the double over them last season. Both 3-1 in those games. I, I usually do beat Liverpool. It seems to be my thing on FIFA. This is the team we're going with. Yes, we've got Sordell up front because I'm mental. And I, do, I just think we need to go with something different. Boyd on the, the wing and we've also brought Shackle in for Reed. Um, so let's just get into this because I, I just really want to win a game. Well, guys, uh, as I said, but as I just said, we, we really do need a win here. We beat Liverpool at Anfield. We beat them at home. Our away form has been ridiculous this season. I think we've only, I think maybe Sunderland was the only game we lost away from home this season, and we, we just we were quite unlucky there, considering we got a man sent off almost straight away. I think that's the last game Shackle played for us, actually. So uh, apart from maybe one of the cup games. So you would think. Oh, look at that! Ruddy's in goal. That, that's going to be interesting. Oh, we need to be careful here already. Oh, it's a good ball. Oh, it's a goal for peace. What is that? Oh, I'm sorry that I'm raging, but I'm just getting so pissed off with this game at the moment. We just can't stop the AI at the moment. They're just running rings around me. I don't know what Heaton's doing there. The defender's just falling back and Henderson scored. And once again, already 1-0 down. Brilliant. And now he's done very well there, George Boyd. Oh, he's done incredibly well. And he's done really well. And he should have got a free kick. And I'm... Uh, just get out of here, referee. Oh, and now they're probably going to score, aren't they? And it's come to Sturridge, and he's onside, and he's hit the post. Thank God for that. And it's a shot. Good save. Good clearance. Bloody hell. Well, quite honestly, it's been a typical FIFA first half, really. Annoying. Just everything bouncing straight to them. We might still be able to get back into this. Into this. Our defending since the goal's been pretty good, but... We need to recatch really them on the counter if we're going to do anything here, I think. Couldn't win that. And Sturridge now! Oh, it's right on the edge of the box. Oh, he's good. Oh, for goodness sake. Mark Noble is sent off. And it just goes from bad to worse, to be frankly honest. I, I, I did press the X button because I was worried about him getting the shot, but... Is that a red card offence? No, I don't think it is. But it's just more disaster. This episode has had no redeeming qualities thus far. And now it just seems to be stuck. And I would put strong money on Vidal scoring this. Um, it's, it's actually played out to Sturridge. Very good save. Okay, guys, we're bringing Guadetti and Arfield on to replace um, Jones, not Jones in the middle, Marnie in the middle even. Uh, so Arfield is actually going to be playing in the middle. 
Ben Mee now can bomb forward and he can cut inside against Johnson and it's into Sordell now on the turn, Sordell get in there, it's Marvin Sordell, we put him in the team, it's a superb turn and completely against the run of play, down to 10 men, we've got the bloody equaliser, you beauty. Brilliant cut inside from me. It's a nice turn. Skirtle was a shite defending as per usual. And once again, we have hope against Liverpool. Lalana, Oh, my God. Where's the defence gone? Where is the defence gone? I'm on defensive. Oh, my God. What the hell was Skirtle doing up there? But thank God he was. It's put into the box. Ake wins it well. Good clearance. And can we play over the top here? And I can't I've only just realised how many players I've actually got back here. And it's played over to Sordell. And he's thrown goal! And it's Marvin Sordell! He's done it again! And yes! It's just typical. 1 0 down to Chelsea, away from home. We recover from that. We beat Manchester United at Old Trafford. And now we lead Liverpool at Anfield. What the hell is going on? Marvin Sordell was a quality finish. Oh, yes. It's back to Ben Mee. And it's our field. Look how much room it, there is for Boyd. Oh, of course, they're going to just come down. Oh, what a save by Mignolet. And our field has the same real. Oh, sorry, Ruddy. <laughs> Oh, what a save that is. Up to Sordell. And it's full time. And despite going down to 10 men with Mark Noble getting sent off, we have still not lost to Liverpool. 3-1. The 3-1 double last season. And now the 2-1 away from home here. And it's Marvin Sordell, the hero, who has... Won it from despair. Well, guys, we are up to ninth. It's only four points off the top four again, so we're pretty much in the same position we've been after every single episode now because we keep getting repeat results of one win, one loss, uh, which sh shows in our results in the four wins, two draws, and then four losses and a relatively equal goal difference. So... At least we jumped Liverpool. We're closer to the top four than we are to the relegation zone. And Newcastle leading the league. So anything could bloody happen this season. In the next episode, we will have three games. It's a definite free game that I'm going for. With Fulham at home. A game we should win. We should win. I, I say, but I mean... <laughs> we'll probably end up losing that one. Then we have Everton away, which we will probably win. And then we will have Hull at home. Three winnable games there, but th this <laughs> this career mode has proved to be the most unpredictable thing ever, really. So, guys, Marvin Sordell, the saviour. Thank you for watching, and until next time, goodbye.